The Raiders and Eagles have met up in the championship game for the last several seasons. Hank the Tank Sablon with a big run here for the Raiders, almost getting into the end zone. Storm Rosario pulled in the first touchdown of the game from quarterback Danny Manabusen. Brandon Burgos pulled in the one-handed grab for the two-point conversion, getting his Odell Beckham Jr. on. Defenses win championships, and that Raiders D was on point, ball hawking all over the field and limiting big plays from the Eagles offense. SP with nowhere to go as the line collapses. Ryan Rios and company getting in for the sack. The Raiders led 14-0 with time winding off the clock late in the fourth quarter. Andy Fernandez comes off the edge untouched, forcing a bad throw. Justin Andre, a.k.a. Optimus Prime, a.k.a. Andre 3000, elevates and gets up for the interception, bobbles it, but was still able to get control of the ball and secure the pick. Jesse Pumpy Maglonio with a huge game for the Raiders. After pulling in the second touchdown of the game for Manabusen, Pumpy gets in on the tackle here. Maglonio sealed the deal with this punt return, bouncing it to the outside for the touchdown, taking it to the house for six points. The Raiders go up 22-0. The defense back on the field for the curtain call. Toss left goes nowhere as the defense gives pursuit. The Raiders are Budweiser Guahan Varsity Football League champions once again after the final whistle blows, ending the Eagles' quest for Tress. Pumpy walked away with this year's MVP trophy, and the Raiders were crowned 2019 champions. To present the MVP trophy to number 22. Okay. Yes, In GML Baseball, the Junior Redhawks edged out the INTME Rays 8-7 to improve to 1-1 one one on the season. The loss also drops the Rays to 1-1. One one. Mark Parks got the win on the mound with 7 strikeouts. Tony Yatar got the loss. Shane Camacho went 3-5 for five at the plate for the Redhawks with a run and double. Darren Pablo finished 1-4 for four with 2 runs and an RBI. Isaiah Meno went 2-3 for three with 2 runs and 2 doubles. Rick Fernandez finished one for three with two RBIs for the Rays. Starting pitcher Kyle Kukendall recorded eight strikeouts. Congrats to Jeff Mesa and J.J. Ambrose for their performance in Australia as the two fighters stepped into the cage at Hex Fighting 18. Jeff fought Chris Waste to a majority draw after three tough rounds. Conditioning played a big role with both fighters as they hung in for the final bell. Great fight by Mesa, who's looking to make a run in the Hex Fight Series. JJ picked up the submission win over Bale Rewari at the 235 mark in the first round. Ambrose got them out after securing the takedown and sunk in the guillotine choke, forcing Rewari to tap. This is JJ's second straight win in the last few months.